Yeah. I got it done. <laughs> it's not quite done, actually. This is not fastened in there or that piece right there because it's going to rain tomorrow, maybe tonight. I wanted to go ahead so I could cover that hole up. Everything down below the ground is done. Those up there, that's going to be where I run for the eye. I am just put that in there just to close up the, so that's going to crawl in the septic tank. I'm going to run it, at it over there. I'm going to run a pipe for my camper. And that'll go up. Because it'll come out of the house up. Because, you know, the house is way up. Like, that pipe is not that far uh, off the floor in there. Well, you know, it's a ways up off the floor. Maybe 20 inches or something. But this is way up off the ground. I'm going to run the plumbing from in there outside, along the outside, just like I did the water pipe. So I ain't getting under the house to do anything. It's very, very low to the ground. And I gotta run a, a vent, you know, so. That's the old vent right there. I still ain't made up my mind if I'm gonna take that down off of there. That cast iron is pretty easy to cut, though, um, with that cast iron blade on the on my electric sawzall. Anyway, don't take very long, so I might do that one. That's a lot smaller pipe. Just take it on down. I can stop that up somehow over there, right? You know cover it with something get it off the house and I can run you know I can run this over and do a vent stack up the side when I tie in you know for in there because my laundry's at least for now it's going to be in there and my big laundry sink and maybe the toilet I might do the toilet in there and just so I'll have one inside. This is where the old bathroom was, I guess. I'm sure it was. Of course, you can't tell from inside. <laughs> Everything's gutted out. Oh, that's all for now. <laughs>